Want to learn how to create beautiful color palettes or how to find the right shades for your shadows and highlights when you're drawing vector illustrations? Well, in this video, I will teach you how to easily create color palettes and show you how to draw and color your illustrations on Adobe Illustrator. I have here on my canvas a few color swatches. I left the color codes there so that you can follow along. What I have is the lightest color I want to use in my illustration and the darkest. But I need to find the colors that would go in between, the midtones. Head over to the object menu at the top and select Blend. Under Blend, go to the Blending options. Click on the drop down menu and make sure you have specified steps selected. Change the unit to 3 so we have 3 midtones. Confirm by clicking on OK. Select the yellow color and shift click to select the red color as well. Go back to the blend tool and select make. As you can see, it automatically created the midtones between both colors. I'll do the same for the green and the brown. Now to turn these circles into actual shapes, head back to the object menu and select expand. With object and fill selected, click on OK. Now that we have the color palette created, let me show you how to use them to color in illustrations. For starters, I will leave you the time to take a screenshot of my sketch so that you could follow along with me. For the outline process, we will use my simple shapes and pen tool style to outline the illustration. I'll let this play out as a time skip. If you're new to the channel, then check the video in my link above to learn how to outline your illustrations using my style. Alright, so now we're ready to add the colors to the illustration. So firstly, select all and head over to the layers panel. Holding option or alt on your keyboard, drag the green square down to the red color layer to create a duplicate. Lock and hide the outline layer. Now on the color layer, delete all small unnecessary lines and details from the outline. We're then going to select all and outline the stroke. Head over to the Pathfinder panel and press the Unite button in order to merge all of our little shapes together. Now let's release the compound path and delete this outer top shape right here. We are now ready to turn on the outline layer and selecting each individual shape and apply a mid-tone color to it. Using the darker colors, we can assign the shadows, which will go towards the bottom right of the illustration. Let's make sure to add some really dark, deep shadows. And for the highlights, apply a lighter tone towards the top left of the illustration.
And there you have it everyone. This is how to use my color palettes to create some beautiful vibrant vector illustrations in Adobe Illustrator. I hope you enjoyed this video and let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Cheers everyone.